Michael Baker. Um, I rode 32, 32 miles so far, and uh, I just stopped. It is 11.50, and I just stopped to call a church that is 50. I want to ride 80 miles today, so a church that is 50 miles. And the first church I got a hold of is uh, North Chiefland Church of God. Praise the Lord. I talked to Gene and told him my story and he said of course you can stay that'd be awesome they're doing a service tonight at seven o'clock so he said uh it's it's an informal more like a bible study so hopefully i can make make it to that um it is raining right now a little bit sprinkling but it is beautiful in the sky so i'm hoping that it dies off a little bit um, I actually got no sleep whatsoever last night. Um, I don't know why it was, uh, I just, I just couldn't get to sleep. So this morning I was just so exhausted, but I said, you know what? Praise God. I'm going to pray for energy. I said, Lord, give me energy. And I stopped at a gas station, got one of those little, uh, energy drinks. And uh, I feel like I got all the energy in the world, so I'll probably sleep like a baby tonight. And um, praise God, everything is going great. You just got to constantly, constantly, constantly keep your mind on Jesus Christ. And everything else works out great. So um, praise the Lord, I thought I'd make this short video just to let you know that I got another place to stay at tonight. And uh, I'm sure it's going to be another holy spirit filled evening and uh, I thank you guys all for your prayers really couldn't do it without them and God is great and uh, I hope God's with all of you daily and uh, one thing that I noticed um, that I was talking to my uh, Conrad about last night is you know what I found out for myself that in order to stay away from temptation to, to, to keep from temptation and worldly sin, you gotta get rid of it. You gotta put yourself in situations that you're not around it. Um, I noticed in different situations, like when I was in Orlando, I was at different places where there was a lot more temptation and watching TV and these, these things of the media, you fall into sin a lot more easily. So when I got back on the road, I felt so much more just in the spirit and comfortable and and i realized that when i forced because literally on this trip being on a bicycle i am forcing myself to to depend on god and that's just what you got to do you got to put yourself in situations where you have to depend on the lord because you know it's so easy to fall out of of um righteousness when you live your worldly ways and get go to work and forget it's so easy to forget about how great our god is but when i you know put myself into situations where i am sleeping in a tent and relying on churches to uh take me in it's it's just i see god everywhere he's, he's just showing up every day so praise the lord i just thought i'd give you that little quick note um because it's just amazing so I love you guys and I'll talk to you later.